YouTube! I'm feeling super excited today, Mom. So, hey, I'm on doing a makeup tutorial, but not any ordinary tutorial. I'm going to do half my face unnatural, really fake, and then one with no makeup. So, it's going to look awesome. So, we need to start off by getting a brown pencil. Let me just move all my makeup to the side. <laughs> Just try to move it all, but anyway. And two. Do I have a mirror? Oh, damn it. Um. Need a mirror, but. I'm just gonna have to use the camera. Right. One second, I'll be back in just a minute. So then I can start. So what I've done, I've done a line to separate to separate my face. Do I do it over my lips? Yeah. One second. That's what you do first. You get a brown pencil. Doesn't matter because we're going to be blending. What side should I do? This. This side. I'm going to do this side actually. So that's going to be the natural side and that's going to be the fake side. Right, so let's get started. Right. First, we start off with foundation. I got really dark, darker than my natural skin colour. And the best way, you know, because if it doesn't have like a little scoop or anything, or a squirter, you just need to get a little sheet of paper, or something, a takeaway or something, that you won't really use. Get a piece of um, not usable paper. You get a bit, and then you just pour some on. Not too much, because you don't want too much. Because you're going to be using most of this. So say about a line. Like this. Anyway, you start off with that, and you just get a small brush. You don't need a massive brush for this. You dip it in. Wrong side. Wait, which side? This side. No, nope, this one. And you start by just dabbing it on. Mm -hmm. I'm doing this with no mirror. I will be back in one moment. I'm sorry I just don't have a mirror. But I will navigate you. Let me bring the camera over here. Just so then I can video myself. I'm doing this in the mirror. So I'm going to leave this here. Then, can you see me? Right. I'm gonna just paint on my face where that line is. Don't go past the line. If you wanna really paint that your face on. You don't have to get your neck if you don't want to. I'm not doing my neck. I'm just doing a line in my neck. This is great for any dressing up parties or Halloween. Just say, oh, not Halloween actually, just like any fancy dress parties. Just like, oh, I'm half fakery and half natural. So you like get a suit where it's just normal clothes and then just bang them out of all the clothes. I will show you the finished look after when I painted my face on. <laughs> this looks pretty cool. Don't worry about that black line. You don't need to blend that or anything. Because it's just there to 
section out your face. Make sure you get all the white bits. Even on your eye, on your nose. Because you want to look as fake as possible. Surprise girl actually wear this. this makeup because it just destroys your face. But this just don't give a poop what anyone else thinks. I need to walk the one now. So I'm just almost done. Right. I put my foundation on the brush now. Duh! Look I'm orange. And on the inside I'm really pale. Let's put you there. Now we're on to the bronzer. Of course you want to dry off all this wet makeup. Okay. I've got bronzing pearls. You get a big brush. If you get some on the other side of your face, oops, then um, you can just get a wipe later and start. I'm gonna be very quick and get a mirror because this is doing my hair a minute or maybe two. So let me run to the kitchen. My mum's just walked in. You can see me. I look orange. So we're basically done with this almost. But we've got blush and this like this powder. This powder is just like any you know where the bronze pills can get. It gets in those spaces. Ooh. Strong, really tight brush, and then get this. Then you just see any patches, you just wipe that on. This actually works for this makeup tutorial because it gets that color that you want. You want a really, really dark color because. The girls fake their natural colour and they look so pale after when they wear this really, really dark orange makeup. If you're missing the nose bit, make sure you've saved that foundation. I should have said this earlier in the video, but save the foundation for any other bits. Uh, I'm just doing nose because the nose is the hardest thing, you know, to like cover because um, 
get it over it. Don't ma it doesn't matter if you get it on your lips, you can just wipe that off. Now we just need to just brush, pop it down a bit, and then get this one and obviously get this colour and do it all the time. And I look awesome, I look pretty cool. The blush, which is pink, like a baby pink. And we use, don't use any light brushes. You want to use really strong brushes for the blush in this. So then it gets such stuff like this. Smile and just apply it while you're smiling. So you have those real pink cheeks that they have to share emotions in their face. You might look a bit of an idiot, but it's a fancy dress, you know. On the other side, if you wanted to for Halloween, you could do like the perfect tanned Barbie, and then the cracked. Do the same thing, but you put cracks in your face and blood, and oh, it just look gore, glory, glorious. See what I did there? Put gory instead of glorious. Don't don't get it, but um. Sorry for my bad jokes. <laughs> a bit more. Just want those rare cheeks. Ha. Now we're gonna move on to the eyebrow. You get let me see. You get a black eyeliner pencil. Black eyeshadow and that's it and you know what you do you draw an outline around your eyebrow do it a bit longer than it naturally is so you just colour it in a bit You colour it in a bit. Then you get black eyeshadow with a black with one of these brushes. I don't know what it's called. And you just get this and this is what makes it look good. You uh you just fill it in. And the other side I'm gonna do nothing except maybe just get in all of it, just brush out this eyebrow. So then you have that slug look that everyone knows. <laughs> that looks so funny. It's coming down to my eye. I'm surprised actually people do this. They have blonde hair and they do jet black eyebrows. <laughs> it looks like there's a slug on my face. It looks so funny. Right. Now, because we're still on the eyes, I use four, wait, yeah, four eyeshadows. So I like to blend in. First one is like just three. And you get a greyish one, and you get a tanned one, and then you get a brownish one. What you do with this, you always start off with the tanned one, and then you get a brush like this, and you. Um, oh, yeah, while I'm doing this, I want to shout out a couple of people. 
Miss Flick. Miss Flick XOXO. She's one of my favourite YouTubers. Go to subscribe to her. You can add her on Instagram. Search for her YouTube name and or she will put it in the link in the description. She's a she does beauty stylist. She does beauty products and beauty outfits and everything. So go check her out. It's amazing. I'll leave her in the description. I don't know if I can link her. But you want to get this base, just leave a gap between your eyebrow. And just do it across your eye. Like this. Like this. And then you get woo, this great one. And you get it and you put it over that tiny base. And then you get this dark one. And you know where your liquid eyeliner goes, but I don't have that. Um, you put it there. So you're going to need a thinner brush like this. And you just get some, put it across your eye, try and make it stand out. Make it cover like half your eyeshadow. And then blend it out with your finger. You get also the top white, this one. And you get the thinnest brush you can find, let's see. Like this, this. And you put the white in the corner of your eyes. Right. We've done the eyeshadows. Time for the black <laughs> and the mascara and the eyeliner. First, I like to start off with a black eyeliner. Put it on your waterline. you get because you can use liquid eyeliner for this on the top of your eyelash where your eyelashes are you put it there you might go wrong but fake rate is fake rate it ruins yourself mistakes are good <laughs> I love, love videos like this. Mascara. I'm using a, a skyscraper mascara. This, I don't know when it came out because I bought it off my friend and um, she just said, oh, this is really good, making your eyelashes look big. because it's going to make my eyelashes pop. If you want to go overboard, black eyeliner and put it under your eye. Make it big and chunky.
<laughs> then, of course I don't have a lip line pencil, unfortunately. We're going to get that big, bold, pink lipstick. I mean, look at that colour. That is just so bold and I don't know. Pastel lips to make them look big. I'm going to do that. Right, I think we're almost done. Just let me check. Yes, we are done. I want to show you the finished look. If you can buy an outfit where it's just half fakery and half normal, and a wig where it's just normal, where you just have half a wig and then you just have it all fake blonde, and all your real hair here. Hey, how you doing? I'm so natural. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to show you the final look. This is the final look. Where oh, my light? This is the final look. Am I going really dark? Anyway, this is the final look. All the pink there. Orange, my eyebrows. Loads of black underneath my eye and on top of my eye. Really big lips. As you can see the difference in my face because um, I like my natural side better because I look like a total idiot. But hey, that's the end of my video. Hope you enjoyed and please share, like, subscribe and do whatever. Okay. See you in the next one.